Hey, Greg Chandler here. Uh, great job on this uh, video on the course, man. Looks like, um, you know, pretty decent swing, too. I can't tell, you know, this ball looks like it kind of just went, you know, up the right side. I'm not sure if it if it drew back, if it stayed straight, um, or if it faded a little. It kind of looks like it went pretty straight, kind of straight down... Uh, straight down this line here so um all in all you know your swing plane is really good um swing plane and everything is really good i think uh just a couple things i see is you know you're getting a little bit far from the golf ball and so your 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 plane line is is pretty high up here through the through the shoulder blades you really want to see that plane going more through the uh through the middle of the back there and so you can just get a little closer to the ball and kind of lower uh your arms and your hands to get on that plane um now i think the only other thing that i see is just whenever you uh if i kind of if i measure your setup here and then I take you to kind of impact. You can see how your your spine, you know, kind of from the top of your back swing to impact, you know, your your spine really lifts, and then it makes you just finish a little bit high here. You know, ideally, again, you'd want to see that club, you know, going more through your through your shoulders here. Um, so a couple things that I would do is I would just get you know, a touch closer to the ball, and then I would just, you know, really feel like you keep your, your butt back uh, throughout the swing. You'll see, you know, there is some pretty good, you know, thrusting there, and, uh, you know, that can put some stress into the low back. Um, so, you know, getting a little bit closer to the ball and, uh, and uh and keeping your butt a little bit more back will allow you to to plane the club a little more through your shoulders like what you see over here on the right side uh with me you can see that you know through the through the release position you know I'm still still in some forward bend but the only way to do it is um you know got to keep the lower body uh you know, a little bit more stable and uh, and in posture. So um, just get a touch closer to the ball and then got to feel like your butt, you know, kind of stays back in your downswing, you know, and all the way through to, to you know, pretty much the finish.